Hey everyone, I decided to make this quick video because I think that most women, in my life anyway, are kind of intimidated by makeup and they want to try stuff but they don't know where to start and it feels like so much and they see all the brushes I have and it's just like why even bother? So this is kind of the video, I think I'm going to call it um, I don't wear makeup, but I want to wear makeup because sometimes you have something you want to look nice for or you just feel like you need a little extra boost, but you're not a makeup person. So this is going to use all the items plus two things um, from our teen collection, which really it's, there's nothing about it that is for our teenagers only. It's just kind of an idea of it's a collection to start for someone who doesn't have a makeup collection. So first off, foundation. Um, I use my sponge all the time with foundation. So lots of people like to use a brush. Well, maybe you have nothing, but you wanna try our foundation. All you need is some type of moisturizer. I've already washed and moisturized my face today, so I'm good to go. Um, but any moisturizer that you currently use would work for this. So what you'll do is it's like you're going to create your own BB cream, okay? So you're going to take a little bit of foundation. I just scraped it off with the end of this drugstore brush. So I put it on my hand, like so. And I'm going to do one little pump of moisturizer. And then I'm just going to mix it together in my hand okay so I am effectively creating my very own BB cream and I will just apply it to my face with my hands and because our foundation is so pigmented this works really great um, I don't know if any maybe I used to use BB creams all the time um, so you do get a really sheer coverage, and guess what? When you're creating your own, you can customize how much you want. If you just want a teeny tiny bit, only put a teeny tiny bit of foundation on. I'm totally getting foundation in my hair. Beautiful. Um, if you want a little bit more coverage, go heavier on the coverage, lighter on the lotion, but it's gonna give you th that nice, um, spread to put it on okay so we've got our nice even skin tone super simple pretty much just like putting on any face moisturizer or BB cream whatever you're used to I have a little pimple right there um, so what else comes in the teen collection? You do get two concealers. The great thing about our concealers, they do really well by just using your fingers. So I'm actually just going to do, I like touch it, okay? I'm going to touch both colors and I'll just dab. Dabbing is very effective. Ha ha ha, not the dance move. Um, to put these concealers on so I look like I got a lot of sleep which I actually did last night Louis slept well score but he's sick today so boo lose okay hmm. got my base all good you get one blush with the um, teen collection so I'm gonna pretend that I'm someone who is terrified of blush and if you're terrified of blush but you want to add a little extra to your face this number six is beautiful. Now, most people can't put blush on with their fingers, so a simple drugstore brush will totally do the trick. Um, Eco Tools is a great drugstore brand. I really like their blush brushes. They're like $7. You can even get a whole little set, I think sometimes for um, 10. Just depends on where you're shopping. They're on Amazon too. Um, so there you go. This is a very subtle flush, but it's really nice. It adds a nice glow. It doubles as a highlighter if you use your finger, so you can use it. Um, actually, we'll use it right now. Use it just on the brow bone. 
can use that as an eyeshadow. If you're going to do that, I do recommend using finger. So next, we've got eyeshadow. Now you get two eyeshadows with um, the teen collection. And it's really easy. I'm so happy to help anyone in picking out two eyeshadows that will work for them and be as useful and as versatile as you might need. Um, two of my favorite and recommendations is 19 and 2. So that's Antiki Bar and that's Peachy Gleam. Um, and I think that you can actually apply these with your fingers if you don't like using brushes. You can get really... If you get the e.l.f. professional line, if you just really want a, like a couple eyeshadow brushes, those will cover you. They're not personally what I use all the time, but if you're starting out and it just seems like too much, I'm really happy to make recommendations that work for you. But I'm going to try doing this with just my fingers. Um, so here we go, Antiki Bar. This is just a beautiful bronzy shade. I'm gonna dab lightly, just kind of all over the lid, okay? These are really pigmented, so you don't want to like dab and then swipe. That's gonna be intense. Okay, super simple. Now I am going to take this blush brush and just kind of go over my whole eye because that's going to blend it out. I am going like that, so it's kind of like smaller, but that's just going to ensure that you don't have any harsh lines since we did put it on with our finger. Um, and then I'm going to take the Peachy Gleam, this light peach color. I'm just going to kind of go on the inner half, I guess you'd say. Kind of tones down the slight bronziness I just created with Antiki Bar. So there you go. Okay. Really subtle. Really easy. The other thing you get with the teen collection is a lip gloss of your choice. So this is like, this is Peace, and this is my wearing lip gloss without looking too much like I'm wearing lip gloss color. This, I kind of feel like this is my happy nude color. <laughs> that makes sense, sounds weird. Um, Faith is another really good universal shade. a teeny bit of pink but not too much and then the last thing is mascara now mascara does not come in the teen collection so if someone was starting out and they just wanted um, makeup to start with I would recommend teen collection and a mascara um, but we all know that if you don't want to buy limelight's mascara which is a shame because it is actually the perfect mascara that's why it's called perfect mascara um, there's some, I mean, we all know where we can buy mascara at the drugstore. And I do have opinions about that too. So if you don't know where to start, I'm sure I could come up with something to help you there too. I love helping people feel good about their routine, but not uncomfortable. You want just the right amount to feel like you, but the more confident version of you. That's my philosophy anyway. So since this is a very natural look, very low key, once again, this is the I want to wear makeup but I don't wear makeup tutorial, I'm not going to like go heavy on the mascara. It's very buildable, um, but it also goes on really clean and light if that's how you like to wear your mascara. So there you have it.
What do you think? Good? You can totally do this. Don't be afraid. I can help. Have a great day, guys.